Welcome! This video will give you an introduction to the Google AdSense for Print program. Our agenda is as follows. We'll first give a brief overview of the program. Then, we'll jump into the advertiser's account to see how a print ad offer is created. We'll then take a tour of the publisher's account. And finally, we'll learn how a publisher maintains their publication settings. So what is the program all about? Here's a quick introduction. The goal of AdSense for Print is to connect new advertisers to print publications, bringing incremental revenue to our partners. Unlike AdSense, which is for online publishers, AdSense for Print does not currently use an automated auction model. To give publishers maximum control, advertisers submit offers to print publications, who then respond to those bids individually. Let's jump into the advertiser's account and see how they make an offer. When bidding, advertisers can find publications to include in their campaign by searching based on various criteria. The primary ways by which advertisers can search are by location and by name. Advertisers may also search by circulation, section, ad size, or publication type. Some of the types of publications in the system currently include paid dailies, college, Spanish language, and alternative publications. During search, Advertisers have the option to learn more about publications by clicking the info link. The information shown to the advertiser is based on settings which the publisher manages through their AdSense for Print account. These settings include circulation, sections, rates, deadlines, and a description, which typically includes demographic and regional information. Once an advertiser has selected which publications to include in their campaign, they are asked to specify their offer details, including sections, ad sizes, days, and rates. We give the advertiser guidance on prices to offer based on the publisher's listed open rate and rates traditionally accepted for similar offers to similarly sized publications. However, advertisers may choose any price at which to start their bid. It's important to note that the vast majority of Google's online advertisers are not as familiar with print advertising and they will often start with a low bid to express their interest. After the advertiser has specified the details of their offer, we ask them to provide a creative if they have one ready. Advertisers can upload their creative at a later date, but they must do so before the publication's deadline. We also offer an ad creation tool that allows advertisers to compose their creative in their account. When the advertiser submits their offer, we send notification emails to each publication in the campaign. These notifications include links for the publisher to accept the offer, reject it, or give a counteroffer. Publications must click one of these links and log into their AdSense for Print account in order to respond. Let's now switch gears and take a tour of the publisher's account. The main page in the AdSense for Print account is called the dashboard. This is what publishers see when they first log in. From the dashboard, publishers are able to review offers and creatives, provide tier sheets, and review their reports. They can also access these pages from the blue navigation bar. To respond to an offer, a publisher must take action from their offers page. This page shows all offers that are currently pending the publisher's response. Each offer includes the advertiser's name, a description of the ad, as well as other offer details. To provide good customer service and to ensure that the advertiser's budget doesn't expire, it's important that publishers act quickly. We've found that the most successful publishers in the program are those that are responsive and give helpful feedback to advertisers. It's important to note that some advertisers may not be familiar with buying print and could require extra guidance. To help publications respond to advertiser bids, publishers can use easily customizable message templates. It's important that publishers provide good quality feedback and counteroffers to advertisers to increase the likelihood that advertisers submit acceptable rebids. Note that advertisers must submit rebids through the system in order for counteroffer acceptances to be binding. If a publication receives an offer from an advertiser with whom they have an existing relationship, the AdSense for Print program provides a tool to exclude that advertiser from submitting future offers to that publication. From the Offers page, publishers can also manage all of their accepted, declined, expired, and canceled offers by clicking on the appropriate tabs. Once a publisher approves an offer, they must also approve the advertiser's creative. For each submitted creative, 
Google performs a content and mechanical review. Once an ad has passed Google's approval and it is considered camera ready, the publisher can then review the creative for compliance with their own policies. After the publisher approves the creative and the ad runs, the publisher is required to upload a PDF tear sheet within two weeks of the issue date in order to be paid. Publishers may also qualify for a bonus to their existing revenue share if tear sheets are uploaded within one weekday of the insertion. The tear sheets page is where publishers upload tear sheets or cancel accepted ads. From here, publications can also view tear sheets they've previously uploaded or ads that did not run. The reports page gives detailed revenue summaries. Google handles all billing and fulfillment and issues monthly payments to publishers, so publishers need not send invoices to each individual advertiser or to Google. Publishers can also use these reports to confirm their ad schedule or to download the most recent ad file for a given insertion. Finally, let's take a step back and see how publishers ensure that advertisers always submit bids based on their most updated publication information. This is done through the settings page. Before a publication can receive bids, the publisher must fill out their settings accurately. The settings page is an overview of the information that the publisher enters when they sign up. This is the same information shown to advertisers when they are bidding. Note that each section can be edited at any time and should be kept up to date. More detailed settings information and videos are available to publishers from within their accounts. Thank you for watching this video. To learn more about Google AdSense for Print, please visit google.com slash adsense slash print.